and welcome to Business Daily. Nigerian banks have seen a surge in impaired loans reflecting the slowdown in economic growth in recent years. Zenith Bank, Guarantee Trust Holding Company, United Bank for Africa and nine other commercial banks booked combined impairment costs of $658.73 billion in the first half of 2023, a 285.2% .2 increase from $171 billion in the same period of 2022 and this is according to Business Day's calculations. It's been a little over four months since President Bola Tinubu's government took office as Nigeria's 16th president and the sixth democratically elected. In those six months, there have been bold moves by the president in a bid to revive the economy. There have also been widely held concerns that Tinubu's approach to governance shows weak execution, particularly as regards sustaining the momentum of reforms or unleashing the full potential of Africa's biggest economy. The prices of major food items such as maize, milk and plantain have almost doubled within 12 months, leading the pack in terms of the largest price increase in Nigeria. According to the latest selected food prices report by the National Bureau of Statistics, the average price of one kilogram of maize grain rose by 93% to 580.1 Naira in August 2023 from 300.5 Naira during the same period of last year, while the yellow species grew by 90.2% to 583.7 from 306.9 Naira. And those are some of our top stories for today. You can read more on our website at www.businessday.ng. Thanks for watching. I'm Elizabeth Musa.